greetings, greetings. You may or may not know that the 117th Congress is now in session. A new Congress has begun and it has a very democratic stronghold in which to make things happen. For years, the HR 40 bill has been presented and rejected and nobody even knew it was being considered. But last year, with so many candidates running in the elections to be president, mouthing off reparations, trying to get the black vote, national attention was given. And because a major focus with debates and discussions concerning it was held, there's been a continual upswing in interest concerning the reparations old and due. At that time, there was no, no support for it, but things have changed because the Senate is now run by the Democrats and able to get the vote to pass it. At the start of this Congress, the bill was introduced again, this time with 147 sponsors and a Senate consisting of Democrats. So I don't need to tell you that we need to watch, push and support this bill, not when it's gotten this far after being totally ignored. This bill is about reparations long overdue and requires a commission to go back and review the deeds, not just under slavery, but underneath our present situation and circumstances and come up with proposals and remedies in which to rectify it by way of reparations. So then the question becomes, who's on this commission? Who's on the commission determining what slavery was and is and continues to be for us today? A very important part of the equation because those are the people who shall determine what we'll get in the form of reparations. This is something that was addressed here on this page several months ago, and many of you suggested that Dr. Claude Anderson be among those on the commission, and a petition was created for that purpose, which many of you signed. You signed it and went on about your business. But if you had continued, we would be ready the minute they signed the HR 40 bill. So I'm going to locate that petition and put it here on this page. And if you and you can decide if you're going to push to have him on this commission or let them decide who they want to put on this commission. I'll also be posting information about the bill itself so you can see and see for yourself what it says and information about it being recently introduced into Congress. I'm doing these things to facilitate your actions and a push for reparations, which should be a collective action of us all, particularly those who are demanding reparations old and due. It's going to be a fight, and we should be in it to ensure that we get what's rightfully old and due. Okay, that's all I have to share for you right now. I'm Dan at Chase, and I'll see you on Facebook. Mm -hmm.